got the Lakers hat. I'm trying to tell you, I knew this was happening before it was happening. When did you get this hat made? Uh, when he was a baby. What, what's it like now that this has come to fruition for you? You've been talking about it for nine months. Nine months? You're talking about 19, 20 years. All right, 19, 20 you years. You the microphone on me when I was talking about it. What's it like right now that he is an L.A. Laker? It's a wonderful feeling, but I already knew what was coming to him. I got two more boys. I got to come do the same thing two more years. So you're going to get them to the Lakers too. How? The big ball away. Ball control. Philly is how, how good is Lonzo Ball going to be for the L.A. Lakers? Hey, I'm going to tell you what. Lonzo Ball is going to take the Lakers to the playoffs his first year. Come see me when he does. I have another hat on to say I told you so. Thanks a lot, LeVar. Congrats. All right, so we got some fucking, we got more news. And uh, Porzingis is, looks like he's staying put. I mean, I'm still watching the draft. It's in the sixth pick right now, uh, Orlando Magic. But some crazy shit did happen. I mean, everyone knew Lonzo Ball was going to go to the Lakers. Well, LeBron Ball, he spoke it into, like, existence or whatever he says all the time. Um, and he had a crazy interview that I'm going to show you guys. <laughs> uh, that I think you already saw, actually. I think I'm going to put it in the beginning of the video, so you guys probably already saw the interview. But yeah, it's just like he's, I don't know. They were saying that he's like a WWE, like, um, like he's like a Ric Flair of the, of the NBA type of thing. I mean, he knows what he's doing. Let's not get crazy. He knows what he's doing. He knows he's being extra for a reason. But anyways, the main thing that happened was Jimmy Butler got traded to the Minnesota Timberwolves for Chris Dunn which was a rookie, I think, last year or the year before. I'm pretty sure something like that. Zach Levine, dunk champion, and the number seven pick. Um, oh, also, they uh, the Bulls traded Jimmy Butler and uh, number 16 to Minnesota. Honestly, I don't like this pick for the Bulls. I mean, it depends who they get for number seven. If they get, I don't know, even though I still don't like it. I still don't like it. Jimmy Butler is too good to just trade for Zach Levine and Chris Dunn. No disrespect, but, like, come on, man. That's Jimmy Butler. He's, like, a top shooting guard right now in the league. But anyways, I mean, him on the Timberwolves, though, that's, like, crazy. That lineup, it's going to be Rubio if he doesn't get traded. Jimmy Butler, Carl Anthony Towns, Gorgie, 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 I can't even say his fucking name. Gorgie Dang, I think it is, or something like that. Um, who else is it? I don't know. They have some really good players. Oh, Shabazz Muhammad or something like that. But, yeah, that, that team is young and stacked, and now they got Jimmy Butler on top of that. That's going to be a, definitely a playoff team uh, this year, this season, for sure. I think that's going to be easily a playoff team. Um... They just got to get chemistry, and then they're set. But, yeah, I, I don't know about this trade for the Bulls. Zach Levine, eh. Chris Dunn, eh. I mean, I feel like they could have did better than that, but whatever. Uh, I just, I'm excited to see the Timberwolves now. Way more than I was. I was already excited with Carl Anthony Towns, but now I'm more excited because Jimmy Butler is on that team. But, yeah, what else happened? Nothing crazy happened. I mean, Jason Tatum, third pick. Uh, Josh Jackson, fourth. Um, you know, DR and Fox got fifth, and, uh, apparently, this guy just got drafted, um, Jonathan Isaac, he got picked, uh, six, was it? Yeah, six. So, Bulls pick is actually coming up, but I'm not gonna be able to tell you guys what it is, um, but anyways, uh, yeah, so that's pretty much what's been, ha what happened in the draft so far. And uh, I'll keep you guys posted. I'll uh, do more videos at the end of the draft. Uh, or when I, whenever anything happens. I mean, if nothing happens after this draft or if that's the craziest trade, then I'm probably not going to post anything after this. But, uh, yeah, I just wanted to keep you guys updated on this crazy-ass Jimmy Butler trade. And uh, that's about it. So uh, I'll see you guys next video. Uh, it might be a gaming video, but, 
yeah i'm definitely gonna be doing more uh like videos like this a uh, little you know perspective on what i think about what's going on in the league because i am an nba fan and i am a knicks diehard fan so i'm definitely gonna be doing more vids like this and obviously i'm gonna stick to you know mainly gaming but you know i still like to do this from time to time so uh yeah all right so literally as i was gonna edit um or as i was editing my video that i was gonna put up this uh the next pick came in and we got frank i don't know how to say his last name i don't know but uh i mean i'm not mad but i just kind of wanted dennis smith jr and he literally as i see uh the mavericks they just picked him and it's kind of i'm kind of bummed out but it happens um i mean we'll see what frank can do for the knicks i know he's a point guard a big point guard uh i'm not like overly ecstatic on him i'm just mostly excited about Porzingis staying and uh you know building around him i hope um and yeah so nothing crazy but uh <laughs> i just wanted to give you guys that update before i uh put my uh video together i wanted to add this in so uh yeah anyways <laughs> make sure you guys uh subscribe if you're new and uh leave it a thumbs up it definitely helps uh whenever you do that and uh yeah i'll see you guys next video peace